Hey guys, this is a quick tutorial into your Samsung DVD writer reader. So first of all, just plug it into your Mac, okay? Whether you have a hub or directly into your iMac, MacBook Pro, MacBook Air, whichever. That's what you have to do. Um, then you have enough electricity to press that button. This should pop up. Then you put in your CD, whichever DVD you have. And then on your Mac, once this light starts coming up, we are just gonna look at your Mac. Okay, so inside your Mac, you guys should see the symbol right here, which is the DVD. Um, now, do you need any drivers for this? No, it should work straight away. You don't need any drivers. You don't need to install anything. So whether it's a white disc without nothing in it, you should see a symbol right up here. All right. So if it's not up in your screen like this, okay, it should be somewhere on your screen. If you guys don't see that on your screen, don't worry about it. Just open up your finder window. Okay, so here's my finder. I'm just going to open it up. Now once you guys have that open, you guys can just close it up. I just want you guys to have that finder window selected. So once you guys see finder up here, just click on it. Okay. Um, from here, you guys can just go into preferences. All right. So under preferences, we're going to see all these options. So we want to show all these items on our desktop. Okay. So. We want our hard disks maybe, in this case for sure our CDs and DVDs. Okay, so that way we can just show everything that we have on our desktop. So make sure to have that checked on. And once you have that checked on, you should see it right up here. Okay, your CD, so just a little drawing of it. We can just double click on it and then we can just drag and drop anything on it if you want to write into it. So for example, this video I can just drag and drop. Um, However, in this particular CD, since I'm reading to it, I cannot write into it. Um, then I, I'm just going to see whatever is in it right now. So I can just see this right now. That's in the CD. And that's it. You can play movies from it. It may lag in some cases. It may not. It all depends. Anyways, if you guys have any comments, questions, you can write them down here below in the comments area. And don't forget to subscribe and rate. One more time, you do not need any drivers install anything. It's just uh, plug and play pretty much. That's it. Thank you.